Hello everyone and welcome back to Kronos Plays Nier Automata. Today we're in Pascal's village and we're gonna go talk to him. Also, I looked up the way to actually use these uh, special abilities like Shift Void or Holy Blessing. They're just passives. <laughs> they, I don't actually have to use them. They're just passive. I'm surprised you wish to speak with me personally. Whatever is the matter? Why? I It'll like be faster you. if you just take a look at this recording. Transfer the data. You didn't have to phase through her. Information him. about this A2 android is indeed contained within our archives. We all understand her to be rather dangerous. However, she's never visited our village in person. My apologies. That's all the information I have. Oh, do why? You're not exactly all hidden right, away, thanks. or have like a lot of defenses. Let's stay sharp and head back to the resistance camp. I just we came from there. Check on our consciousness data and resupply. I mean, sure. To be fair, I don't think there's any other, like, side quests for me to do. Which might mean I'm actually the best person at side quests ever. Maybe? I don't know. Resistance camp. Let's go. I'm assuming there's going to be more. At some point. Maybe? I don't know. Oh! Um. I do want to check that out, don't I? I do want to go check that out. Shit. So, the guy, Masamun, he mentioned shrines, and I questioned whether it meant those places Why did you ask Pascal about, about huh? the things. It's not recommended to interface with machines without consulting command. Yo. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Though I suppose such intense curiosity can be admirable in its own way. <laughs> Thanks, 2B. Still, machines are the enemy. Don't forget it. You seem different this playthrough. Maybe because I'm not controlling you and, and like, imparting my personality onto you. To 9S. Oh, God. This is your regularly scheduled contact. Yeah, yeah. No problems here. Yeah, yeah, Copy yeah. That. I also need to inform you that the commander offers her personal praise for your recent achievements. Woo. As a direct result, we are currently considering boosting production of your model. Yeah. Really? I'm happy to hear it. I couldn't have done it without your support, Operator. You're always so cool under fire, not to mention... Beautiful. Wrong time to flirt. Flattery is unnecessary. Operator 210, out. I really meant it, though. Yeah. There's a time and a place, 9S. And it's not always welcome, and sometimes you just have to get used to rejection. All right, uh, where are we going? Uh, we're going back to the desert. Yes, because there's one right by the access point to the desert. I'm assuming... Because didn't... I don't know if Masamun actually mentioned those shrines before. He mentioned the weapons before. He never gave us uh, a weapon in general. Though. So, I don't know. Um, I think it's like right down there. I actually can see it from here. Go draw distance. Yeah, apparently what Shifoy does, it, it literally just makes me teleport like Noctis. And uh, changes the damage number color which is kind of hilarious okay do I, I gotta deal with you guys first I mean that the the damage is not that great this is true I probably could put a two-handed sword on that will do a lot of damage but for some reason I can't bring myself to equip two B weapons onto this guy and I'm not exactly sure why. Ow, dog! Not cool electric boogaloo. No, you, you die now. Thank you. You die too. Thank you. I mean, I don't really need this money, probably. I have a lot of large recoveries. Hey, dog. Can I come in here? Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, no. Why? Why did you have to find this place? You are fortunate enough not to be qualified to enter. But, oh, how cruel the gods can be to allow such misfortune to occur. Please, you must get away from here as far as you can. This den here will be detrimental to your health, as you will be slowly consumed by rage. There's only one thing I can do for you now. I will, nay, I must self-destruct. This will result in a rain of useful materials. They are yours to keep. One day you will discover the truth. And of that, I am sure. May you live long and healthy life. Can you just let me in here? 
No? Alright, fine. Alright, you know what? I wish I could enter the menu when I jump. Uh, let's come here. We've been using a small blade for a long time. We've been using the engine blade for a good amount of time with him. Uh, let's go ahead and switch it up a bit to not that. Should upgrade that one. Is that the strongest one? That's the one that 2B's using, though. Let's do this one because it has attack speed up. This is 2B's weapon. And I don't want to do that. But it is pretty badass. Alright, let's head back to the resistance camp. Oh, there's a chest here. Yeah, I was exploring the bunker because I wasn't sure if there might be a quest up here or not. And I didn't even know there was a maintenance shop up here, to be quite honest. Large recovery, really? <laughs> That's it? Alright. No, that like, I'm almost actually able to upgrade one of my pods. I know, right? Like, finally! <laughs> I just need, like, four more pure water. Do not break, camera. Camera! I swear, thank you! Big jerks. Did that, like, the second episode and scared the crap out of me because I thought I broke the game. I mean, it really didn't scare the crap. Anyways, let's go back to the resistance camp. And then, I guess, talk to Anemone? What was next? Um, trying to remember the story progression. We don't go to the flooded city. No, is it the flooded city? The, uh... Have we reached that point already? Wow. Ah, the second playthrough really does go by pretty quick, doesn't it? You've got mail. Mail notification received from access point. Dope. Alright, what is it? I don't know why I keep quick saving every time I come in here, but 9S, servage, manager, server capacity. To all users, it has become to our attention that this bunker's main server is approaching maximum capacity. Please organize your user folders and delete any old data to free up space. Additionally, there are many members who have saved large music files and entertainment videos, which do not appear to be mission critical. All such data must be transferred to local storage at once. <laughs> oh, it's like work all over again. All right, Anemone. What do you want me to do? Oh, 2B, your timing is impeccable. Our android forces currently have a carrier deployed in the Pacific Ocean. Flood City. It should be back here to resupply before too long. The Resistance is assisting with the mission, so I'd like to ask you to run a little guard duty. Seriously? Dead serious. There's a stockpile <laughs> of missiles down at the shoreline that needs to be loaded on the carrier. And with all the machine activity lately, we need to stay on our toes. Of course. If you're already working on something for Yorha, I don't mind if that takes priority. Anyway, thanks in advance. I mean, to be fair, I don't think like we ever hear from Yorha again until, uh, well, no, that's not true. Right? Cause, no, because we contact them and they're like, hey, so-and-so brought so-and-so to, like, this location. All right, let's see how uh, much damage this stuff does. I mean, about as much as it was before. <laughs> he juggled him! Uh, I don't like that one. I mean, it's not bad. It has a long swing. But it's, it's not bad. It's a machine core. Titanium alloy. we not just, like, teleport to the Flooded City? I feel like we could've. Oh, you know what? I kinda like... Ooh, what was that? Oh, that's a long range. Um, I accidentally unequipped weapons, oh, not too long ago, but, uh, and I was just, like, attacking with, uh, 9S's, uh, unarmed. And the dude is badass! Like, I want to be able to do that all the time. Am I in the right area? Yes. Yes, there we go. I mean, I guess we could have just teleported there. Oh, uh, maybe not. I don't know. There might have been a trigger or something where it's like, you, uh, you missed. Are we sliding? I think we were sliding. Yeah, we're sliding. 
I should keep an eye out for locked treasure, though, because I think there is one in here. To be fair, the uh, these locked treasures, they're, uh, they're appearing a lot less frequently than I remember based on my initial playthrough. <laughs> like, I remember them being all over the place. Then we actually have a means to unlock them, and then we white out. Yeah? What's going on? Why must we read all these books, Oh, brother? hi, Steve. Knowledge expands horizons and enriches existence. But can't we just transfer all this data over instantly? That's a good point. Into your head, perhaps, but not to your heart. I don't think you guys have hearts. I guess. Hmm. Hey, so... Yes? My name? Eve? <laughs> this book says it's a woman's name. Shouldn't we be called Cain and Abel or something instead? Oh. Humans wouldn't change names so easily. Besides, no. you should be proud of the name Eve. Huh. Well, if that's what you think... Hey, unless one of you kill I'm the other one, then it. he can be called Glad Cain and Abel. Hear it. I like how he brought the um, fact up that his, his name is, there something is else? female. After we're done reading, can we go out and play? I'm sure it'll be tons of fun. All right, but only after we're finished. You mean it? Then I'm gonna try extra hard to finish this. Yeah, you're actually extra, making me like these guys. Hard. You do that. Which is sad, because I'm gonna have to kill them soon. I mean, to be fair, they are, they are dicks. In their own right. Like, they killed a bunch of androids. They, like, messed with machines, kind of. I actually don't know if that was their doing or, like, if it was in response to us. I would actually probably have flipped my lid if he was like, why didn't you just call me Steve? That would have been amazing. <laughs> I wonder how... It must have been in their databanks or something. I was going to say, I wonder how um, Adam got his, like, how they got their names in the first place. Like, how did they know that? How did they check the Bibles or whatever book of Genesis, whatever the hell the book is, to, um, to pick these names? The bedrock here was bombed out in the last war. Looks like the whole city is starting to sink as a result. Yeah? I think I'm gonna go back to small weapons. I don't know. I'm not feeling it. Maybe I'll go back to Cruel Oath. It's a little bit weaker. But it is his weapon, so... I, I like... I feel like I'm doing more damage with the small swords. Probably because I'm hitting them more? I don't know. No, I don't like the look of that guy over there. Like, that guy sucks. And he's gonna hurt me. And he's here. He's here already. I can actually not see anything. You know what? You dead yet? Thank you. Level up! That's how you deal with them. That's how you deal with a lot of things. The bombs. I like how we stayed a persistent like 10 levels over these guys. Does that mean I'm just over leveled in general? Or... Did they just not skill them up for the... Well, too far up for uh, the new game plus. Is that what we need to protect? Let's take them out already so I can be home in time for dinner and a bath. Androids don't need to bathe. Yes, as they do. Did you see A2? Maintenance, bathing is unnecessary. Yeah. Smells, come on, says the smelly be. woman. It still feels good. Ow. It does feel good. Oh, Jesus Christ. No. Can I, can I hit you? Thank you. I don't think I've hacked one of these yet. I think I'm going to regret hacking one of these. As I take damage instantly. No! 
You know what? No, we're doing that again. Do you, you don't you dare try to mega buster me, god damn it. God damn it! <laughs> I think I broke his attack animation. You know what? That's fine. I don't I don't need to hack you. You're dead. Oh hi. When did you when did you get here? Oh you brought friends. That's a little worrying. I love his blunder attack. Cause it just blends. And then kills them. Yeah, small swords are like just so good. The spears are alright too. The the unarmed attacking seemed dope, but I don't know if it did any damage. So I mean we'll never really Well no, I know it doesn't do any damage. It's like a base a hundred damage, so it's kinda crap. The uh, the unarmed fist weapons though, so Come that in. might be better. Commander? Emergency orders incoming. The carrier ship that was set to resupply has come under attack. Oh yeah, they do actually talk to us here. Of I forgot that. All your troops in the city like, I knew we went after Goliath stuff, but I thought that was like resistance well. asking. I'm sending flight units and coordinates now. Dope. Out. It's been a fairly decent amount of time since I've done this, so I'm probably going to fail at it. And I remember, you see, Cronus, you can actually use Oops. melee attacks. If she didn't order others around, what kind of leader would she be? I don't know, not a leader. If you say so. Uh, which one do you want? Do you want this one or that one? Uh, let's take this one. So yeah, melee is possible. Remember that, friends. Hopefully we don't die. One turned white already. I actually did not mean to do that. Remember, you can melee the hell out of things, including, like, the black orbs down. Also, are we just, like, straight up ending? Okay. You know what? Never mind. Forget I was saying anything, game. Forget I was saying anything. Can you start me in the flight? And please do not take any of my chips away. I swear to God. Don't do it. Okay. I gotta gotta get my uh my reflex ready for healing. Ow. You got it. That was close. That was Close to the fact that it hit me. As a transformer rollout time. All right. Hitting something. You know, melee is actually really strong <laughs> in the flight units. Kind of wish I realized you could use that like way uh, earlier. Though it does put me in harm's way. This is absolutely true. Thankfully those did not do any damage to us. Ow. Coming. I'm coming for you. That's a lot of enemies. Oh, thank you, cutscene. <laughs> I, I actually did not heal in time, so thank you, cutscene. Oh, man, that carry get destroyed. Attention, this is Carrier Blue Ridge 2. Requesting support from any friendly units in range. Uh, I'm not friendly, but I'm in range. From the enemy. Our escort ship has taken damage and is unable to engage. We're currently resisting with all remaining support fighters, but we can't hold them off for long. Pete, this is Carrier Blue Ridge 2. We need immediate backup from any available Android forces. You gotta be careful of, like, the mass amount of ones that will show up. That's, it's when they start becoming, like, so dense that it's just a screen full of bullets and enemies. That's when I start 
being unable to heal myself and, uh, like, killing the enemies in time. To be fair, my melee attacks are, like, one-shotting these guys. So, that's good. If I can just get that off, then we're, we're good. Picking up a large-scale enemy inbound. Looks to be 2.8 clicks southwest of us. I don't know what that means. I mean, I know what's going to happen, but I actually don't know what two-point click self of us means. Like, where did you come from? You're dead, right? Okay. Just making sure, because I just, like, went full ham on you. aerial unit destroyed. Reverting back to area recon- Wait, I'm still picking up a large enemy presence. Didn't I kill that already? What on... If it's that big, we should be able to see it. <laughs> I mean, that's a good point, but you forgot that there's underwater. Frame rate. I think that's just how the cutscenes are sometimes. Well, that's new. I know it's not. That's the second time that has happened. Yeah, kind of. It's freaking huge. It'd be kind of weird if it wasn't machine. Be like, what the hell happened? We gonna do anything about it? Or we just gonna stand here. Kind of creepy looking. Oh, crap! It's blocking close range attacks with EMP blasts. We've got to find another way to damage it. How about long, long range attacks? Operator like, say, from a missile. To 9S. I too Command has decided to stage a direct satellite laser strike on the hostel. We need you to destroy the enemy EMP generator so we can lock onto the target. EMP generator? Sending the coordinates to your map now. Also, why don't we have those? EMP generator target confirmed. Marking on map. Proposal. Destroy the generator quickly. Thank you for the proposal. You freaking sassy son of a gun. I mean, that's a good point. For, like, little machine life forms, you're sassy sometimes, Pod. Ow. Okay. Didn't actually hit me. But I would like... Can we fly over there faster? So it, like, won't let me target this guy. And he is shooting missiles at me. From command. Go ahead. The only Ow. record of this machine life form is a lone sighting 320 years ago. Upon reaching land, the unit unleashed a devastating electromagnetic wave attack. Yeah, I should probably do something All about the it then, right? Like, fly the over there! Annihilated. So basically, if this thing reaches land, we're screwed. Affirmative. Oh, not good. Itching nose! Itching nose is never good! I got a really itchy nose for some reason now. Why? Nope. I don't trust you. There we go. Can I attack it now? Oh, can I hack? Ow! I cannot hack it. Can I, can I pretend to hack? This is a lot easier when I have melee and bullets. Okay, ready? We do that, and then we do this, and then it dies. Man. Oh, that was Confirmed easy. <laughs> elimination of electromagnetic interference. Stand by for incoming satellite laser strike. That's pretty cool. I do like that. Oh, come on! 
It's got an electromagnetic barrier over its whole body? I mean, I guess so. That's good defense. Can we get that? <laughs> Having trouble over there? Are you Yorha? Hunter Squadron deploying out of North 12C Defense HQ. I'm the commanding officer, 4B. Don't worry, we'll take it from here. Dope. See you later. 2B, let's leave this area to the reinforcements. I have an idea. You and I should meet up at the spot I just marked. Oh, I get to use the big gun now, right? I like using the big gun. We've got mortars lining the shoreline here. All the EMP shielding in the world won't help against close range mortar fire. Got it. I'll help aim. Also, if it's not like. like machine. <laughs> Excuse me? Oh, I thought like I could hack 2B for a second. Am I supposed to do this? I don't get to shoot the thing? <laughs> this thing's armor is too thick. We need more firepower. 2B, let's try for a more direct approach. Direct? Oh, right. That's right. Lay down some fire in its stupid mouth. I'm so disappointed. Okay, I would like to hack the machine now. Thank you. See, I can't have fun. shot. I think you killed it a lot faster than I did. <sighs> like, roar, I'm a turtle. Not really a turtle, more like a Cthulhu monster. But fair enough. So they're all gonna die. There they go. To me. We got a bail, to fair, to like, This is bad. How do I do that? Let me do that in game. <laughs> Man, that tentacle attack is never fun. Are you all right, To be? Am I actually here? Oh, huh. this machine is an ancient weapon. Oh wait, that comes afterwards, it's right? Designed to help annihilate the android, but it wound up going out of control. I was part of the machine's network when it happened, so I remember it. The moment it reached land, it went berserk and began attacking everything in sight. No one could figure out how to stop it. We eventually tried bullets deep in the ocean, but it seems to be searching for a way back. Huh. Hey, 2B, I think I have another idea. You keep that thing right where it is, okay? What? Please, 2B, this is gonna work. Level up. Oh, that's right, he did the, okay. Right, something new. Okay, same old stuff. 2B, I'm going to see if we can use those missiles back on the shore. But I need you to destroy the EMP unit on that thing's back. Otherwise, they're just going to go off course. Right, we do use the Resistance's missiles. I, I remember now. I remember like it was a week ago. Two weeks ago. Oh shit, how long has it been? Three, three weeks ago? Maybe three, no. Like a week, two weeks ago. Maybe. I was never good at these sorts of games on the Atari. Not oh okay. To be fair, they didn't have games too much like the song. They had Asteroid. I sucked at that. I think everyone sucked at that though. They had a lot of games like this on Super Nintendo though. What the hell was it called? Galaga? It might have been Galaga. It was like a few different brands. I mean, obviously none that looked anything like this, and none of those had melee attacks. So. Well, I mean, they had varying weapons. I'm 
Sniper seems a lot easier than the first time we did this. It's also, like, exactly kind of like the first time we were here. Not the first time we were here, but, like, the first round of the enemies we fought. Except for this guy. This guy is completely new. I could have used my missiles. Probably would have ended him. Activate missile controls. Prepare to launch. Missile controls engaged. Launch ability confirmed. Am I gonna have to control this? Fire. I mean, that's fine. Just so you we're clear, I might miss. I didn't think oh, this crap. would be so hard to control. Alert. Obstacle ahead. A collision at this speed is not recommended. Aim for the mouth. I'm aware, thank you. Aim for the mouth. Got him. <laughs> How did Pascal live through that? S signal lost. Don't worry, 6 0. We're alive, probably. Organize a search and rescue party for the missing Yorha members at once. To be. Nine S. Don't die on me. I mean, you have our backup data. Ooh, vibrations. The child held sway over enormous strength, but sadly, he was also a little bit broken. He spent his long days hurting those around him. He tried his best to be good and kind. But despite his efforts, things never seemed to turn out. They told him he was unwanted. They abandoned him in the deep, dark ocean. Oh, that's and so from the cold sad. at the bottom of the sea, oh my God. he cried out, Mother. Why are you making me feel bad for the giant monster we just killed? But his voice never reached his mother. I'm now sad that we killed that monster. He just wanted to find his mom. This is Tactical Support Unit Pod 042, assigned to 2B. This is Tactical Support Unit Pod 153, assigned to 9S. We pods often participate in the same battles. Exchanging our situational data would theoretically allow us to plan combat strategies in a more efficient manner. Proposal. Data should be transferred regularly between Pod 042 and Pod 153. Didn't we? Analysis. This idea is sound. Didn't we already see this? Proposal accepted. Records will be organized in time for the next situational exchange. Didn't we already see that? I thought we already saw that. Oh, uh, is this hacking space? How did I... How did I... What? 9S. How did I end the episode? Like this. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press the like button below. If you're not subscribed yet, when you enter my video section, check out some other content and see if it's true. Like once again, thank you for watching. Hope you all have a great day.